day, lovely ladies and gentlemen. I'm Seik, and welcome to another episode of my Let's Play of Assassin's Creed Odyssey, and let's get into whatever this is. Oh, okay. Hello? I swear to God, if at the end of this DLC I get kicked down there, into the next DLC, I will have called it. <laughs> <laughs> Alexios, I'm glad you've come. Would you blame me if I did? I learn your trust in time, and we can begin that process now. This door will lead us to Kronos' treasury, where the gauntlets you'll need are stored. I have the key here. If you want me to trust you, you have to start being honest with me. Why do you have the key? Hades had me tidy the treasury for him once. I'll need those gauntlets if we want to catch the monger. My thoughts exactly. I'll offer my assistance as your personal guide through the treasury. Let's just get this over with. Of course, Mistyus. Whatever you need. Ah. Tread carefully. <laughs> Gotta be faster to take some kills from me. Looks as though this path can be cleared from the other side. Hmm. Ah. And obviously I gotta go to the other side. Draw your bow. Eh. If you wouldn't mind climbing across and letting me pass, I might consider it. Then again, I might not. I'll see what I feel when I get there. All dead? All dead. Easy. I do hope you are clearing the path for me. I want a treasure. You can wait. This game. <laughs> Why do I even gather stuff like that any uh, still? Out, damn flames! Out! <sighs> I've got a light! Shit! Away, child of Ephestus! The lava ain't that bad. Kill me, yes, yes.
these numbers, man. <sighs> Where do I open his gate? This does not seem like There you are. You do realize how much time we could have saved if you had cleared the path. You left me to fend for myself. You seem to have made it here in one piece. Whatever here is. Cronus's treasury. Cronus hid all his worldly possessions here, far away from the sounds that had been prophesied to be his undoing. It was my favorite story as a child. All the myths, stories, and epics told throughout the generations were transpiring beneath us all along. And now we get to play among the gods, together. Let's find the gauntlets, quickly. Over here. Over here. Yes. I swear to God, if I have to equip them manually, like... These gauntlets will help me get past the veil. Thanks for your help. My pleasure, of course. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> oh God, I have to equip them myself. Perhaps you found it in your heart to clear the path for me now. I have mil still no freaking so, uh, idea. Working for the God of the Dead. Really want to know. Try me. All the myths and stories that have been closed to do Hades justice. It's got me inspired. And you have to make my life. Something's blocking this. I'll get through it. Huh. Won't budge. Huh. Oh, finally. Something's in the way. Yes, 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 yes. Something in the way. Where do I even have to go to open his way? <laughs> Where has he gone now? Okay, and now, now what? <sighs> Game, you're really not helping me.
didn't I? What? There he is. Let's keep going. Oh, stop your bitching, man. Another ambush. Good thing there's two of us to fend them off. Good. It might be overselling it. Down here. Oh, <laughs> I thought I could go jump down. <laughs> the armor of fall will pierce Tartarus veil. I'm faster. <laughs> Where is he? Behind me. Or behind me. It's just always in those games. What are those giant bones from? Like it's neat art style for you know a region, but what if you'll never find creatures like these? Why bother? I need to stay hidden. You're quite hidden, I'd say. I can't fight them without the armor, right? The full set, of course. Bye. over there, right? Lost but not forgotten. So I gotta remember I gotta end the episode in about one minute. Huh. Unfortunate. Come on. What's gonna be? A set of footprints. Too small to be an adult. Oh, don't tell me we're gonna find Phoebe. What could those bones belong to? Dolls in the underworld. Small footprints, dolls. My guess is it's gonna be Phoebe. What's this? A message? 
Dear Matar and Patar, you've never met me and I've never met you, but it's time to change that. If you find this letter, meet me north of the Barren Pond. I will wait for you there. I'm I'm gonna meet her. I I still calling it, it's Phoebe. Right? Is there was there another child? No oh, game stop pretending. Yeah. Call it game stop pretending like you I need Icarus to find stuff. Phoebe? Call it. Oh, Phoebe, I never thought I'd see you again. Are you a god? Phoebe, it's me, Alexios. It's nice to meet you, Alexios. Is that your eagle? I wish I had an eagle. Huh. She remembers nothing or what. This must be creepy to her. Playing? How do you know my name? I could never forget your name. There hasn't been a day I don't think about you. I don't remember you. Do you work for the man with one eye? Who's that? He gave me this water when I was thirsty. You drank Lethe's water. <sighs> Phoebe, this is very important. I need you to remember who gave you that. I... I don't remember his name. Um, he took my toy. What a dick! an eagle, like Icarus. If we get your eagle back, maybe you'll remember. No, I remember everything. I think... You drank forgetting water. The man with one eye should never have given you this water, or taken your toy eagle. We're going to get it back. You mean, steal? Stealing is exactly what I mean. Something tells me you're going to be a natural. Want to come with me? You want me to come on an adventure with you? Okay. Then let the adventure begin. Okay, but this is where I end the episode. Huge thanks for everyone for watching, and if you'd like to do me a favor, please comment it down below to let me know if someone actually made it to the end. Have you ever been there? Oh, she was <laughs> brave and smart. Oh, talk. She'd say she looked up to me, but I'm the one who looked up to her. Yeah, feel free to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more, and goodbye.